Your words are powerful. As a matter of fact, the Word of God tells us that there's the power of life and death in our tongue. Words matter. They tear down. They build up. They make things better. They make things worse. What you say and how you say it is important. Speaking to the situation or speaking about the situation. God in the creation account steps out on an earth that is dark and void and without form. And he doesn't say, boy, it sure is dark out here. He says, let there be light. And so sometimes we need to choose our words wisely and speak life and speak light and speak hope and speak encouragement and build up and not tear down. There's enough negativity in the world right now. And our words can encourage, our words can strengthen the tone in which you speak, the manner in which you speak, how you speak, when you speak is as important as what you're saying. You can say the right thing in the wrong way at the wrong time. If it doesn't make it right, it makes it wrong. Jesus in the New Testament, when he was given the loaves and fish to feed 5,000 people, he didn't say, boy, this is not enough, or why do you bring me this? This is just a little bit of fish and a little bit of bread. He blessed it. He lifted it up. He didn't look down upon it, and he blessed it. And that word blessed there means to speak well of or to speak a good word over. What are you speaking over your situation? What are you speaking over your circumstances? What are you speaking over the dark places in your life, the places that need life, the places, the people that need love and hope and encouragement and strength? The power of life and death is in your tongue. What you say matters. How you say it matters. When you say it matters. Life and death are in the tongue. Choose wisely.